Hey grade 3 Ramadan Kareem, I hope you're having a great Ramadan. Welcome to your video lesson today for Phonics Unit 6 Week 2. Go ahead and grab your books to follow along with me. Today we're going to be doing pages 159 and 160. Our objectives today are we're going to be learning with the consonant plus LE sound and the meanings of some words. Alright, so let's go have some fun. So we get L-E at the end of some words. And how does L-E sound? It sounds like L. Let's read the words in the box. Able, tunnel, nickel, towel, eagle, pickle, castle, little, camel, handle, puzzle, squirrel, travel, riddle, and purple. Now if we look at these words, they all have the same ending sound, L. But some of them are spelled L-E and some of them are spelled E L. Some are spelled L E and some are spelled E L, but they all have the same sound. Able tunnel nickel. So we don't say able, we say able tunnel nickel towel eagle. So we don't say eagle. Eagle is the same sound. So our first our first exercise is we want to write the spelling words that contain the matching spelling of the final consonant sound. So here we want to write all of the words that end in L-E and all of the words that end in E-L. That's the first job that we're going to do. So we have able, purple, riddle, handle, eagle, puzzle, castle, little, pickle. E-L, towel, Nickel, camel, travel, tunnel, squirrel. They all have the same l sound, but this is spelled L E and this is spelled E L. In B, we want to compare the words pickle and nickel. How are they alike and how are they different? They both have the same l sound at the end, but pickle is spelled with L E and nickel is spelled with E L. The words pickle and nickel are rhyming words. Both words end in the same L sound. The sound is spelled L-E in pickle and the sound is spelled E-L in nickel. Alright, let's head over to the next page and solve page 160. Before we begin, let's read the words again. Able, purple, riddle. Handle, eagle, puzzle. Castle, little, pickle. Towel, nickel, camel. Travel tunnel and squirrel write the spelling word it goes with the other two words red blue purple all right red and blue are colors and purple hawk owl so hawk is a type of bird an owl is a type of bird and here was another type of bird eagle great job mansion palace a big house, all right. A mansion is a big house, a palace, and a castle. Penny, dime, nickel. Penny, dime, and nickel are all coins that we have in the United States. A penny is one uh, cent, a dime is ten, and a nickel is five cents. Tiny, small little all of these are synonyms all right all of them have the same meaning tiny small and little all right let's go down to b and complete the sentences it is fun to something by trains and planes it is fun to travel an earthworm digs a deep something underground it digs a deep tunnel now in Makkah we have lots of tunnels, right? The tunnels here in Makkah they go through the mountains. So an earthworm digs a deep tunnel underground. Did the something bury an acorn under the under the tree? Which animal, right? We don't have them here in Saudi Arabia. When you look at the cartoons, which animals bury acorns? Squirrel. Did the squirrel bury an acorn under the tree? I lost a piece of the something and can't finish it. If you lose a piece of a puzzle, then you won't be able to finish it. 
Alright, so if you lose a piece of a puzzle, then it's div you can't fix it. You guys love puzzles? If you're home now, this is a great opportunity for you guys to solve. Solve puzzles. Alright, jigsaw puzzles. You can buy them. I think you can get them online or if you have any at home. It's a great opportunity. You have a lot of time now to, to finish puzzles, right? It's a fun activity to do with your parents or with your siblings as well. Is something is a desert animal with a hump on its back. Now here, this animal, we don't have squirrels in Saudi Arabia, but this animal, we have lots of them here in Saudi Arabia. A camel is a desert animal with a hump on its back. Will you be something to go to the movie with me? Alright, we say, can you come or will you be able? Will you be able to go to the movie with me? It is fun to figure out the answer to a riddle. Alright, a riddle is a question that has you have to think to answer or to think to solve. So it's fun to figure out the answer to a riddle. Let me give you guys a riddle. Let me see an example of a riddle I can give you guys. Alright, this is a nice riddle. What becomes wetter the more it dries? What becomes wetter the more it dries? A towel. Because you use a towel to dry your skin. So the more you dry with it, the wetter it becomes. Because it takes all of the water away from your body. So this is a riddle. A riddle is a question that you need to think to answer. I eat a crisp green something with my sandwich. Uh, some people enjoy pickles on their sandwich or with their sandwich. So I eat a crisp green pickle with my sandwich. We needed something to wipe up all the water we spilled. What do you use to wipe up stuff? A towel. Very good. And I broke the something on my new suitcase. I broke the, the handle, the thing you hold in the suitcase. Alright, the thing that you use to move the suitcase, the handle. So I broke the handle on my new suitcase. Alright, I hope you guys had fun today. I hope you enjoyed our lesson. I hope you enjoyed all of the videos that we had over the past few weeks. And inshallah, I need you guys to stay safe. Enjoy your Ramadan. Enjoy your summer to the best of your ability. Inshallah, this disease will go away soon. And we can have a great summer, inshallah. And we will see you back in school next academic year. Bye.